What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 6 for my playthrough on Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. In the last episode, we defeated Zapdos, the electric legendary bird. Now we're going to be moving to the Great Canyon and visiting Axu. So if you guys are excited for today's video, make sure you support the channel by smash that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Also, let me know in the comment section down below if you are enjoying this playthrough. I'd love to know who hangs out and watches this because I'm having tons of fun with this. Before we do head to the Great Canyon, we're going to head over to the Pokemon Square. You guys know the deal. Head to the Kelkion shop to get started on the day. See if he has any good items for us. Let's see, what you got, my dude? Oh, double tiny reviver seed. I'm gonna stack up on them. I'm gonna stack up on these tiny reviver seeds. Give them up. I'm actually gonna buy these. See if they have any TMs in stock. And I'm gonna buy some uh some friend camps as well. So maybe we can befriend some Pokemon on the way up the Grand Canyon. Let's get it. Let's go. No, I do not want anything else from you. You got any TMs? I know I don't have enough cash for TMs. So I would have to go to the bank. But might as well check right here. Buy some items. Let's see what you got, my dude. We got oh, we got energy ball. I need this. It teaches move energy ball, a damage deal, and special move. Yeah, that's uh very good. That's a very good move. Move details, I can actually check it out. Look at that. Thing's beasting. Four tiles away. It damages the enemy even if one far away. Could lower the special defense. Yeah, that is so much better than Dragon Breath. I can get rid of Dragon Breath. Say bye-bye to it. So I think I'm gonna get that. There's Grass Knot that's bigger on heavier Pokemon. We got Giga Impact, False Breath. I think I'm gonna buy Energy Ball and give it to my boy. And give it to my boy, because it is special. And I believe Trico is a special attacking Pokemon. We gotta bring out tons of cash here. Oh, I don't even know if I wanna buy it now. Mm, maybe we should save it for later. Maybe we should just save that TM for later. All right, we're just going to withdraw a decent amount of cash, probably like 3000 and just buy a bunch of camps, and we'll save the rest. Right, that's fine by me. That is totally fine by me. Oh, give us an apple. Nice. Every time, like, you deposit or withdraw, like, a decent amount of money, you'll get, uh, what's it called? Okay, what do you mean? Come on. I know I know what we got to do. Stop. I'm trying to talk to Luigi. But every time you deposit a good amount, he'll usually give you an item, so that's pretty good. Let's go. List the camps. Let's make some camps here. We're going to buy a decent amount. We got both planes. I don't want to buy one that's going to go with uh, the canyon. But let's see. We got Withering Desert. We already have that. We have Ravage Field. Let's for like Houndor, Skarmory. We got Crater. I think. Oh, Crater's for like big Pokemon. 5,000. That's a lot. Boulder Cave. Um, Yeah, let's buy Boulder Cave here. We'll buy Frigid Cavern as well. In case some Pokemon in there we can grab. So we're going to buy these right here, and then we're going to get smoothing along here. But actually, I actually want to head to the Kangaskhan storage first. You guys already know. This is like our daily beginning of the video stuff. We head over here, we buy some camps because we got some more money. Then we go over to the storage, put some things away, grab some things for our adventure. And we always check the Calcion shop because that's like the best thing to do. I want to put some tiny reviver seeds, but it's always good to just have them on you. Tadpole Pond. What else do we want to go? We kind of want to buy some seeds. Oh, seeds are nice, but let's buy Tadpole Pond for right now. Look how expensive these like seeds are. Like Rub Dub River, 3,000 Poké Dollars. We're going to start getting some up there. Gonna start getting some up here. Let's go. Let's buy that one. I'll buy one more. I'll buy one more camp. Let's go. Which one do we want to buy? We got Treasure Sea. These ones are all expensive. Magnetic Quarry. Mm, one more. Darkness Ridge. No. A lot of these are expensive. I might buy Mount Discipline. We get Tyrogues and all that. Do you do Gligars, Teddy Rooster, Mount Green? I think Mount Green is like one of our better ones. Because there's so many Pokemon you can get in there. There's just a stack of them. Like you saw it on the bottom right corner. Let's go. Ta! Yeah. Give me that camp. Okay. So we just spent $3,000. We've been working so hard to get in camps but that's good that's good now we can actually get some more pokemans and we're gonna head over to kangaskhan storage put some items away then get moving along there store up baby uh defense scarf i kind of want to keep them and give them to my pokemon let's actually sort these out all right we'll get rid of two max others uh we'll keep the defense scarfs on us tiny reviver seeds how many do we have let's get rid of this uh slow one we'll keep a blast seed on us we'll get rid of this rossberry this max both of them we'll keep some of the others uh, bum, bum, bum. and yeah i think we're good i think we are chilling from there yeah, store away. There you go. That's all we want. That's all we want right now. And then we're going to just move along to the Great Canyon and progressing through this main story. Let's go. I was going to do some dojos, but I feel like our level's pretty decent. Maybe I was going to give one to Poochiana. But we're chilling. Look at all these stuff. We might have to do some missions later. Just like do some, just to get some rewards and all that good stuff. Let's get moving. Let's depart. Get on our way to the Great Canyon and go visit Axe 2. Because if you guys remember, in the last episode, Axe 2 is a guy who like knows everything. Kind of like Alakazam. So we're going to go talk to him and figure out what's going on. Let's get it, yo. Get in there, Trico. My boy, Trico. But, dude, that boss fight in the last episode, if you haven't checked that out, go check it out. Boss fight with Zapdos is pretty dope. Oh! What is this thing called again? I forget what it's, what it's called again. It's Skip Loom, that's what it is. I'm gonna step behind, diagonal, and then I can actually use some Dragon Mask. Yo, hold the phone. Uh, Mudkip, I'll actually give you one chance here. We have tiny revival seats. I'll throw a Dragon Mask here. Oh, nice little crit and the Paralyze. That's beautiful. We got this one back. That hook picks up the KO. And, of course, I step on a Sleep Trap. Get out of here. And now we got enemies coming up here. Thank you for stepping in front of me, Mudkip. That was actually huge. Mudkip steps in front. Oh, we get another paralyze? Yeah, we're two for two on the paralyzes. That's big. Imagine if we would have got this vile plume. 
No duo here. He wants sauce. Yo, you rage on me? That's why I get that Mega Drain. Boop. Get that 21. What did he just boost? His attack? It's kind of scary. He might take us out. Nope. Mudkip comes clutch. Look at Mudkip flying in here. Oh, he drops a chest. Don't mind if I do. A lot of enemies here. Right off the bat. That's Iron Tails. Of course we missed. He just thinks Teen off over on that dead duo. Double water gun, dude. Mudkip's speed is just how speed is. <gasps> you hunk of junk. You poisonous. Okay, he missed. It doesn't, it doesn't have effect on this quick attack. Yeet. What you mean, yo? What are we missing left and right for? Barry went. That's it. Yeah, yeet. 36. Big damage. Don't, it has no effect to me, man. Trying to poison me. Trying to poison me. We'll double quick attack. Get out of my face. Grab these Pokey Dollars. And we'll get rolling. I feel like this way is the better option, to be honest. I just feel like the stairs are over here. Yo, poison doesn't affect me. Why are all these Pokemon trying to poison me? Yeet. Big 40 Iron Tail. Water Gun's going to fly through. Sunsport, now that will not affect me as well. Like, <laughs> these dumb Pokemans. Yeah, dude, look at this. I had a feeling that the stairs were over here. Let's get it. I don't know how many floors this Great Canyon is. I'm guessing, like, maybe 10. Maybe 10 around there. We're going to try to get moving through it. Yeah, you, dude, Iron Tail hits so hard. Water Gun should be able to take it out from here. Let's see. Nope, 19. Does it take out? It does not. Bite that thing, Poochiana. I guess I'll fix it all. Poochiana took his turn by stepping. What is up with all these enemies in the Great Canyon? This is crazy. Poochiana's type nice. I like to have this Poochiana here. Considering it's level 16, way better than the Magmite. I could go Electabuzz, but I feel like that's too powerful. A level 30 Mon. Like, I'll bring him in for boss battles and stuff. But, like, come on. Poochiana's a lot cooler. I'd rather level up Poochiana as well. Because this XP will actually go towards more value for him. So take that out. Let's roll up here. More Skip Blooms. Skip Blooms are everywhere. Yo, look at my boy Mudkit. Taking that side step to get that angle on. That's type nice. Iron Tail levels up. I really do like that starter moves for uh, Trico. I feel like he's just a good starter Pokemon because he has such a good, like, coverage moveset. He starts off with Dragon Breath, a grass move, quick attack to hit through tiles, and Iron Tail for big damage. Like, it's so nice. He was such a good pick. Oh my god, stop trying to poison me, yo. These things are hilarious. Boop! 38. But I wish Mudkip had quick attack as well. So now you Mega Drain me and you get a crit. Dude, get off my face. Now I'm gonna have to Mega Drain you. Get out of here. Just get some HP back so he doesn't take me out and hit it. Is Water Gun KO? I think it will. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Get moving. I don't think we have a boss battle here. I think we're just going up to see x And then maybe another boss battle later. Probably not in this video. Probably in the next episode we'll have another one. Yo, you stunned my boy? What you want? Get quick attack. Let's go, Kipper. Kipper, I know you're slow. What up this way, Kippy? Yeah, what's this thing like? There's so many enemies. Jeez, I don't think I ever versus this many enemies right here. There's a ton. Let's go. We gotta stay up with this Kipper. The Kipper's a little bit slower. Yo, Kipper, get that Paralyzed off. I'm real sick of it. There you go. Return to normal speed. Let's go, boys. Onward! Onward! Down the Great Canyon. No duo wants a sauce. Boop! Of course we miss. Dragon Breath. Yeet. I know there's a band you can get that doesn't use any PP of your moves, which is probably, that's pretty good. I would love to have that. Of course we miss. Um, I think a Dragon Breath should kill. I have Reviver Seeds, if not. Yeah, see, Dragon Breath does kill. And I'm actually run here back and forth. Just to get some HP back, because each tile you run, you get some HP back. And of course, we step on a spiky trap, and we're legit on one. That is insane. That is insane that we hit a spiky trap and almost killed ourselves. Well, let me lower my, or bring my stats back. Now we'll get smoothing along. Back up to 39 HP. Dude, I thought we were going to die to a spiky trap. The third floor, rolling. What you want, Iron Tail? Boop. One of my favorite moves, and it drops defense as well. I was gonna buy that uh that energy ball TM, but that was actually very expensive. Plus, I just want to buy camps. I think like Dragon Breath is kind of this work right now. We'll definitely get it later on in the game. Definitely, energy ball is gonna rock out as a special attack and move. Let's go, Mega Drain. I think Trico's special attack. Oh, it might be half and half, but it works pretty well because it has Iron Tail. I think its stats are decent, but I think its special attack stat is a little bit better. But you shouldn't be afraid to send out some physical attack moves with this Trico. Quick attack. Nope. And then Mega Drain. Give me some more HP back. Does that KO? Any quick attack? Poochiana? No, Poochiana doesn't have quick attack. Yeah. Bro, what is up with me stepping on all these dang traps? So annoying. I do like to get to all these Poke Dollars. I need more and more every single time. Because we spend a ton every single episode. Got to run low. Let's go. Apples. Apples are always clutch to get. We want. I see Dunsparce coming over here. Go quick attack. Nope. Step up, Dunsparce. Look at that. Double quick attack, baby. And water gun for the KO. Get out of my face. Surprised we haven't befriended anyone yet. We're just marking on fools. We're just marking on them. Again, only fourth floor. These, like I said, these dungeons get bigger and bigger every single time. Oh, Murkrow. Oh. Now I got a Mega Drain, you. Get some HP back. Give me my 11 HP back so you don't kill me. Dang, dude. Murkrow teeing off on me. <gasps> Bro, yo, this thing had wing attack. I was scared of it. I thought he was going to use, like, Peck or something. And he just murked on me. But we got them tiny Reviver Seeds. Good thing I bought a couple. 
I actually should have swapped out my Pucci on here. Just in case that thing was going to wing attack in. That thing did some big damage. I got to pay more attention to that. Like, super effective Pokemon. When going to teal off on me. All right, this Murkrow, I'm chilling with because I can just Dragon Breath him. And then quick attack him. Boop. Of course we miss. Iron Tail. I think we kill with the Iron Tail. Yeah, get out of my face. I want to befriend one. I know I have some, uh, like, flying planes and all that. Somebody right here. Oh, yo, Breloom. Double Breelooms. I would love to befriend one of these. These things are tight. Nice. What you want? I just can't let it hit my kip. Tackle. Yo, what you want? Get out of your Mega Drain. Need some HP on this one. Breelooms are tight. Nice. Oh. Okay, right, I'm Mega Drain you again. Ooh. Get out of here. That's your KO, right? We befriend it. We did not befriend it. And Poochie Anna levels up. You can tell who levels up by doing, like, they put their head up or their hand up into the sky. Poochie Anna levels up. And, like, I want to go after this thing. But then I don't at the same time. I mean, I have Orenberry, so I'm going to step to the side here. Uh, give me an Orenberry, please. Thank you very much. <laughs> I knew I should have took that thing on. But we'll take this Orenberry. We'll be back to pull up. And the stairs are here anyway, so we have to go this way. I just got to watch my back here as well. One bomb, nice. Oh, he's, he's leech seeding me. Does that not affect me? Yeah, my type won't get it. That's all right, I hope this lands. Yeah, there we go. And we got to watch out for this one. Come and throw that. I would love to befriend one of these things. These things are so cool. Yo, Faint goes that far. And Poochian is going to burst a Murkrow on the other side. Faint's coming through. Um, I got to hope this Dragon Breath takes out. <gasps> Thank you, Mudkip. Thank you, Mudkip. Give me another Orenberry, yo. I'm getting teed off on here. He stepped up anyway, so we're chilling. I should be able to KO here. Thanks for the help. Because if he would have used Faint again, we would have died. Look at our HP. 74. We actually got a ton. Why do we have extra HP right now? Yo, knock it off, buddy. I can't quick attack through that. We're gonna have to hope Poochie on it doesn't work. Dang, we didn't get a Breloom. Let me check my items real quick. Let me honestly check my items real quick. We have apples. We have one orange berry. Okay, so that's not bad. We should be able to find more on the way. Let's get schmoovin' schmoovin'. Why do I have 74 HP? Is that how much I normally have? Or what happened? I don't know. Oh, beautiful. We found an orange berry, and this thing wants a sauce. Yeah, ye. I'm gonna have to eat a max uh, ether to get my PP back. Oh, hold the phone. Hold the phone, buddy. Fuck okay, it. I'm gonna need you to take him out. I have another tiny reviver seed. I'm sort of shouldn't take out here, and then I should be able to clean him up with this Mega Drain here. I'm gonna I'm gonna give me and Mudkip a max ether as well. And be chilling. There we go. Nice little level up here. Trico goes to 20. Let's get it, baby. You you wanna learn a move? Learn something cool. Alright, level up. No move, but let's get some ethers out here. That's why I bring these. That's why I bring these. Give this to Trico. Give it to Dragon Breath because we like those tile moves to shoot across. They're type nice and they actually help out big. So we don't have to get up close and personal with a bunch of Pokemon. And then we'll have Mudkip drink one full water gun. We still have a little bit ways to go with the Great Canyon. I think we have another five to seven floors. We're going to get moving. I should have went right for those items, but all those enemies went that way. Well, bro, another spiky trap? Why? Why am I stepping on every single trap today? We're hungry. I know. I got some apples. Here's some Poke Dollars and a beautiful... Oh, a Cacturn. I would love to fight this thing. What you want, Cacturn? I'm going to hit you with this Iron Tail. Of course, dude, of course we missed, but we got this thing, like, in a corner right here. He's not going to be able to take us out. You know, arm comes through. Wow, dude, that was actually some big damage. Mega Drain's going to fly through. Poochiani can just bite it, or Mudkip like, can do something dirty to finish that thing off. I'm actually going to get some HP back before these enemies come. Or Mudkip. I really don't want to go into the next floor and just have an enemy tee off on my Mudkip. There we go, Great Canyon, 4-6. Oh, there's a Kelkion Chop. We're going up to it. We're going up to it. Oh, and an Apple, perfect, as we were getting hungry. Kelkion Chop will be this way. And this Breloom doesn't want the sauce. Oh, big crit, baby. What you want? I'm a Dragon Breath again. Finish it off. Befriend it. No, no friends here, dude. Nobody wants to be our friends. Cacturn, what you want? Oh, dude, they got some orbs and all that. Orbs are actually very good. You can get some really good orbs, like the power-up orb. Oh, yo, dude, what's your problem? Now I'm going to have to Mega Drain you get some HP. That's what he does. Destiny Bond. Oh. Will cause the same damage. I'm going to I'm gonna step back to Poochiana. Let Poochiana do some work here. Thank you, Poochiana. Look at that. Poochiana just tees off and Destiny Bond goes off. But what's up, Kelkion? What should I get? What we got here? We got an eye drop seed. No, I do not want an eye drop seed. What kind of orbs we got? Wiggly tough orb. Did you access a wiggly? Oh, in a dungeon. Oh, that's pretty cool. Powder orb. Confuse. All enemies confused. That's pretty good. And a slumber orb. Um, I'm actually going to pick this one up. Uh, bu -bu -bum. I'm actually going to pick up this. We might actually want to use this wiggly tough thing in here. That would be type nice. And I'm going to pick up some apples as well. It gave me both these apples. Do I have enough money for this? Yeah, I, I have 800 something. Okay, let's roll. I could steal it all, but I'm not like that. I'm not about that. Kelkion. Oh my god, Kelkion. Yeah, I want to buy it. Thank you, buddy. And now we have this Murkrow over here. What you want, Murkrow? We're going to fight in your shop real quick, Kelkion. Take this thing out. Poochie to bite him and finish him off. Oh, Mudkip just gets crit. Thank you so much, Kelkion. That'll work. And we are hungry now. We me bought some apples. Apples are tight. Nice. Nice sword here. Look at all the apples we have. We might have did overkill on the apples. But we're fine. We're fine. Get that 50 hunger back. 
Yeah, get moving along. Come on, give me this Poke Dollar. Yo, Poochiani. Oh, Fampy. I would love to get a Fampy. Yo, give me So that Wigglytuff is actually really nice. We can we can cause uh, the what's it called? We can maybe get a camp if we need it. Why did Iron Tail? Just Iron Tail. Like in the middle of a dungeon. So say we befriend a Pokemon that we do not have a camp. I can use that Wigglytuff or maybe buy a camp if we have enough money for it and then roll out from there. I want to finish this off. I kind of want to befriend one of these. Uh, Breloom is one of my favorite Pokemon. I don't know. I always love Shroomish and all that good stuff. But yeah, we are befriending no Pokemon here. Seventh floor of the Gut Eighth Canyon. Show me Tiny Reviver Seed. Is it? Oh, yes, sir. Tiny Reviver Seed, yo. These things are the best. Head up towards the items. -na 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 -na. Oh, another Tiny Reviver Seed? Come on, baby. Oh, doubling up on the Tiny Reviver Seed. You'd love to see it. You'd love to see it, baby. That's the best things to pick up, those tiny reviver seeds. Because they're not, they're kind of hard to come by a little bit. Got a cacturn here. We're going to surround this thing. Well, not surround it. I'm just take a nice little advantage over here. Get that giant double dragon breath. Get that paralyzed. Let's step up here. Get him now. What you want? Iron Tail should be with KO. Befriend me. Be my friend. Nope. No one wants to be my friend. That's all good. Uh, we got these boys coming over here. What is that? I see it. I don't know if we're going to reach it. We do reach it. What is it? It's a Murkra. Oh, good thing we did. We're double dragon breathing. What you want, fool? Uh, I do not have quick attacks. All I have is Mega Jane. I might have to use a Max Elixir on Trico because I need to move. Yeah, I'm very, very low on moves. Payback. Uh-oh. He's going to raise his defense here. This little water gun. I should be able to just finish this thing off. Poison thing. Oh, you. That was a bad idea, buddy. Now I'm coming for you. 90 damage. Give me that HP back. Did I take him out? Nope. Mud Kip will. Get him. What you want, Cat Turn? Spiky Shield. Okay, so I am just going to skip out on the turn. Of course I hit him. He's protected by Spiky Shield. Don't use a physical attack move. Nice one. Nice one, Poochiana. I just told you not to use a physical attack, and you do it anyway. Yeah, I have, like, three moves left I can use, and then it's game over for me. Well, not game over. I'm going to have to use, like, a max elixir. Well, from there. But what we got up here? Nice little thing. Oh! Look at this thing. What is this thing called again? I forget what it is. It starts with A. I know it's the little bug second stage. Aridos. That's what it's called. Aridos. Okay. Another tiny reviver sheet? Oh, my lord, yo. It's crazy. What we got here? What's this? Another one? Another one? Oh, I dropped seed. Uh, I'm going to actually go to the next floor. How many floors are left? It really depends. I might just use the max other because the max elixirs are really good. But I don't want to waste it. How many do I have? Do I even have one? I don't have anything. I have no... I will have no moves. I will have no moves. That's a fact. I guess I use all mine. So, um, that thing is not sleeping. I'm going to let Poochie undo some work here. See all. And there's a bunch of items up there, which I would love to get. And of course. Of course. Would you have guessed it? I stepped on another trap. Pokey Dollar. Come on, show me elixir here or something like that. We got more, just tons of pokey dollars. I don't want to head over here just to see what's here. here. A little petra berry. Don't mind if I do. Give me that petra berry, baby. I'm going to head over to these, this floor. This is the 10th floor? Okay. How many floors is this? I, I'm telling you, I think it's like 12 or something. Like that. I don't, I don't, I got to step forward. If, oh, horn attack's coming after my mudkip. Go after me. Hit me, please. Oh, mudkip just tees off. Nice. Step on that. We're going to boost moves. I'm going to, I'm going to swap with, I'm going to go over on this side. Yo, whoa, 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 buddy. I have plenty of tiny reviver seeds, so I think I'm fine. I think I'm chilling here. And Poochiana should be able to do big damage. Um, no, I really don't want to waste the orange berry. I think we're fine. I really do think we're fine. I think Poochiana or, yeah, somebody was going to take it out. Let's go right here. We're getting hungry again. Grab this. What we got over here? More Poke Dollars. I'll take them. Don't mind if I do. I have to eat an apple soon. Actually, here's the floor. Let's sneak in here. Is this the end? Is this the end? No, yo. We still got another floor, baby. <laughs> what we got there? What's up here? Another Poke Dollar. We're stacking up. I'm out of moves, so I don't really know what to do here. I'm going to hit him with that. And I'm going to let him step up. I'm actually step back and have Mudkip do some work. I have one move left, so I might as well save it until I really need it. Dang, dude, we did not come prepared here. We got to go find some items. I'm actually going to eat an apple real quick. Go eat an apple, baby. Give me that. Eat it, baby. I could just switch to Mudkip, but you guys already know. I like to play a streaker. <gasps> a Hound Door. Mudkip can tee off on this thing. He's going to howl, raise his attack, and step over to the side. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Nah, we're chill, we're chill. Let's go. Show me some elixirs. Here's the stairs. I would love. Here's a Petra Berry. Yo, what is that? How door just popped out of nowhere. Poochiana, help him. I, I can't get back there in time. Poochiana, help my... Okay, thank you, Mudkip. Mudkip can do it. just do everything on his own. We got two items down here. Lots of money in here. And then we're just going to head over to these stairs. Hopefully, we don't get in a battle with this thing. See, I'm a teal. What you want? Oh, he's plowing up. I'm out of here. He's boosting his special attack by two. We out of here. Actually, unless the boy... No, we out of here. We out of here. Still another four. Dang, man. Here's the stairs, yo. We out of here again. Get me out of here. Fight's teeing off. Is this it? There we go. We finished it. Yo, we were running out of moves. But here we go. Made our way all the way up the Great Canyon. We're, vis we're visiting Axu. Axu 
supposedly lives here. So we come up here. This is the Hill of the Ancients, Mudkip says. Look, over there. Is it our boy? It is our boy. Just who we're looking for, Axe 2. We're going to finally figure out what's going on with this game and all that good stuff. Come on, baby. Let's go visit this dude. But I was legit on, like, one move left. Excuse me. Are you maybe Axe 2? Dot, dot, dot. Question mark. Hello? Dot, 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 dot. Question mark. <laughs> maybe he doesn't hear us. Maybe he's deaf. We don't know. Hello? <laughs> yeah, this dude's just not speaking to us. Hello? <laughs> it's useless. He's not responding at all. Maybe he's sleeping while on his feet. That would be pretty dope. Let's tickle him. Yeah. Let's tickle him. Okay, worth a try. Boop, boop, boop. Tickle, tickle. <laughs> Yo, this game cracks me up. Tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> Yo, we're just tickling this axe, dude. He's not moving. Yeah, keep tickling him. This game, bro. This game cracks me up. It's no good, Trico. He's not responding. Snort. Oh, we got him. We got him. Huh, Snort? Giggle. Oh, yeah, we tickled him. <laughs> yeah, yo, we made him laugh. He's finally laughing now, is he? Just dense. Whoa. We have to fight this thing? He just, like, clawed at us. Indeed, I am axe, too. You discern my true identity. You are not an ordinary sort. Yeah. He's kind of... They're trying to, like... Like, we came here to figure out everything. And now Axu... Axu has that big brain power just like Alkazam. He kind of knows everything. I think he, he knows that we are a human Pokemon. We're just going to keep talking to him and figure out what's going on. As we were talking to Axu, he knows that we are actually a human in a Pokemon body right now. And he says that has to tie in with all the destruction and everything that is going on with this Pokemon world. Like all the legendaries going crazy and trying to fight us. And Gengar climbed up here and noticed that we are also a human Pokemon. So that is actually going to lead to some trouble. So he overhears the conversation. He's like, yo, Trico's a human Pokemon. I got to tell everybody. But we make it out of the Great Canyon and we're chilling here. We got a Bronze Dojo chicken from the treasure chest that we did obtain in there. Now it's the next morning. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on, my dude. But I feel like something bad is going to happen. Like, Gengar is going to tell somebody. And something's going to go crazy. Let's go. Next morning pops up here. We're normal. So far, so good. Good morning, Trika. Let's keep on doing good. Actually, I want to ask you something. What do you think about what Axu said yesterday? Does it bother you? Yeah, a little bit. It kind of bothers me. Because he said the future is actually crazy. And he dreads it. Like, he said it's just destruction and all crazy. So, we're going to probably have to do something about that. And get rolling from there. Brand new day. Let's get rolling here. We're going to head to the Pokemon Town and see what's going on. Oh, and we have another cutscene in the town. Okay. People are chatting in the middle of town. Who is this? Lombre. Yo, look at my boy Bellsprout and Snubble over here. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. Hey, what's happening? Well, you know the Ninetales legend, that old story? Nah, not really, my dude. We do not know what the Ninetales legend is. He says it's an old fairy tale that we have to learn about. So in order for us to actually learn about it, they're going to like to send us up to Wishcash's Pond. And Wishcash's Pond is actually... Right above us. That's like I think I showed it off once. Flying up here. Yeah, he see he just pointed to it. It's right up there. It's just Wish Cash chilling in a beautiful, lovely little rainbow pond. So we're gonna go head over there. Actually, give me a second. Just in case the day switches, I wanna check the Kelkanon shop. You know this is the, this is the daily deed of the day. What you got? You got apples. Max Lister, give me that thing. Give me that. This things are the bomb. So we're gonna buy that for later usages. Now we're gonna head over. Now we're gonna get smooth and grooving. No need to really deposit any Pokemon money because I might use it in the next dungeon. Whatever we wanna do. But yeah, what's good, Wish Cash? What's good, my dude? He's asking us, do we want to hear this folklore of the Nine Tails legend? Oh, yes, we do, yo. But look at this place. It is gorgeous with the rainbows around us. Here he goes. He's telling us the tale now. What is going on here? There once lived a Pokemon by the name of Nine Tails. Now Nine Tails had many tails. Yeah, it has nine tails, hence the name. All of them imbued with psychic power. It was said that anyone so foolish as to touch a tail would be cursed for a thousand years. But there was someone so foolish to grab the tail. Oh, dude, what a dummy. And it was a human. Okay, that's probably me. I don't know. <laughs> a human. Yes, a human. As one might expect, the human that grabbed the tail was subjected to a thousand-year curse. However, just when the curse was cast, a Pokemon named Gardevoir shielded the human and sacrificed yourself to absorb the curse. Okay, why? Why would that Pokemon Gardevoir take the human's place? To Gardevoir, that human was her partner. Okay, there exist strong bonds between humans and Pokemon. Okay, so this is like more information for us, so... Gardevoir is probably going to play a big role for us in protecting us as we are a human Pokemon. So that, that, that tale was to show us that Gardevoir is like the human guardian and that bonds between human and Pokemon are actually good, not bad. Because most of these Pokemon think that the human, because of the whole Nine Tails folklore tale, is terrible in the Pokemon world. So there we go. He tells us a story. We do not want to hear this again. 
Certainly some rumors that the legends say may actually be true, but it only ancient folklore is nothing more. Okay. Do I want to hear your tale again? Come again? Nah, dude. We do not want to hear your tale, but look at this place, bro. This place is saucing. Little rainbows, the waterfall, and Wishcash is just living his best life over there. Okay, what do we want to do from here? I actually want to drop off some items in the Kangaskhan storage and actually maybe take some out before we get home. Let's go. Let's go store some items. Uh, let's actually... I want to sort these real quick. Okay, so we... Apples are good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold on to some apples. Tiny reviver seeds. We got three of them. I'm going to actually drop one off. Keep a petra berry. I'm going to keep that orange berry. Get rid of this cherry berry. Plain seed. No, I want to keep my orange berry. Plain seed gone. Uh, this will go out of here. And we'll keep these two just in case something bad happens. I'll get rid of one apple as well. And then we're just going to... Uh, I might actually pick up some more orange berries as we are here. And some elixirs. Let's actually take out. What we got? So we got nine max enders. Let's take out three of these. Take out three of these bad boys. Yeah, I want that. And then, bum, 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 we got big apple. A perfect apple. Ooh, big apples. That's the type nice. Uh, we took out max others. We have some, what's stamina band, dude? Mm, that's for your belly. Okay, lucky ribbon. Fences from getting crits. Got some orange berries. Oh, oh my god, we actually have some max elixirs. I'm gonna actually take out two. I can, get, I, can, I can take out two of those. And, bum, 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 what else do I want? What do we got? We got all these other things. Rain dance waterfall. Ooh. Um, I kind of want... We have plenty of Reviver Seeds. I think we're chilling on that. I kind of want another, an extra orange berry. We'll, we'll, we'll bring two out of here. And we'll go see what's going on. Let me talk to Mudkip and see what we have to do from here. Yo, what's good? What you want? Let's talk to Mudkip. Dot, dot, dot. Nothing. Okay, maybe we head back here. Let's head over here and see what's going on. Yep. You know what cutscene's coming when the screen fades out like that? Say, Trico. Want to call it a day? I can't seem to get motivated today. Yeah, I guess so, Mudkip. Can't get motivated. So we're just going to call it a day. Good thing we did check that Kalkion shop. Before coming back here, so tomorrow we can actually check it once again. But yeah, we're gonna call it a day. We're gonna get rolling here. Mucket, you're walking away all sad. What's good, my dude? Something's going on. Look at him. Trico, sorry. I started doubting you a little, Trico. Yo, don't you ever doubt me. Don't you ever doubt me. Now he's saying he believes in us and all that. But I can't say man at Mucket. I can just pinch those little cheeks of his. Whatever's on him. This little gills, fins. I don't even know what they are. But he's adorable, especially with that scarf on. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go to bed here. Night, night, Trico. I feel like a dream's gonna happen, because they never really show us sleeping unless a dream. Yep. Like I said, let's see what's going on. So the dreams, like, is, like, Trico, like, finding out himself and everything. Having these weird dreams. And, oh! Look who's here! Gardevoir! Gardevoir is here. Who could it be, he says. But that's Gardevoir. I don't know if he knows if, if it's Gardevoir, but we know, we know. I can't make, quite make it out. It's clearer than it was before, but I'll try talking to him. Yeah, talk to him. Hello, please tell me. You. Who are you? Come on, Gardevoir, help us out. I am, I am Gardevoir. Gardevoir, oh! Yes, sir. Gardevoir, up in here. Let's get it. I'm so glad, finally. I finally got to meet you. Huh? Finally met me? You knew me from before? What about me? I am your. I am, you are my what? Oh, wait. Just a little longer. No! I think this appeared. I was about to tell us what it was. He is our what? Okay. The Gardevoir has something to do with us. Like, that's the whole point of that folktale lord, but it's kind of cool that we know that now. The Gardevoir is something for us. That's pretty dope. Let's go. That's it. Gardevoir. It was Gardevoir. Yesterday, Wishcash said, yeah, Gardevoir is part of us. We go to a little bit of flashback. Yo, look at my boy with his big whiskers, yo. I love Wishcash's pond. That's type nice, but it's just a flashback showing us how the dreams and the Wishcash tale is uh, connected. Let's go. Do we tell Mudkip and all but I'm kind of scared to see what happens next. I, I, I'm feeling something big is going to happen. But we're going to head out here on our day. Do we have any missions to do? Or are we just going to do some rescue missions? Morning, Trico. Yeah, what's good? Oh, you look pale. Is something to matter? Well, anyway, as always, let's try to do our best. Yes, sir. Let's get it, Mudkip. Let's get it, buddy. Let's head over here. Let's head back to the town. Just see what's going on. What we got over here? Another cutscene? Jeez, man. What is up with all these cutscenes? The cutscenes left and right. The town's empty. Whoa, hold up. Why is the town empty? Why is the town em empty? I literally just noticed that. It just faded out and everything's empty. What we got going on here? What we got going on? Look, why is everyone gathered together? Something's going on here. Hi, what's going on? Oh, what's good? Let me tell you, I, I was amazed. It really was true. Hmm? What was true? The Nine Tails legend. I never believed the rumors, so you can bet I was shocked to learn the truth. Oh my god, did Gengar tell the town? I have a feeling Gengar tell the town that we are, uh, that we're a human. That's why they're all gathered here saying the Nine Tails tale is true. Yeah, look at this. Look at this dude. I hate this guy. He's always up here giving me crap and all that, making everything worse for us. So he's telling everybody that we are human. Or did he say he was originally human? 
Let's see. No, no, he's telling everybody that we are human. Bro, dude, this guy ruins everything for us. Come on, get out of here. My dude. Like, we already murked on him. Do we have to beat him up again? Do we have to beat him up again? He literally is just bothering us since day one. We got in this town, just new guys, and he's just pestering us. Like, get out of my face. Get out of my face, Gengar. Yo, it's about to go down. Something's about to happen. They all know we're a human, and Gengar just told him what Axu said, that the human and the destruction of this Pokemon world is all connected in one. So I feel like they're all going to turn on us or something. But what's going on? What is going on? Everyone, what's gotten into you? What are you doing? Oh my god, they're all ganging up on us. Oh, yo, we out of here. We said, yo, let's hit the bounce boogie skididdle and get out of here. Serves them right. I'll do this hunk of junk. Oh my god, they were all going to jump us. Imagine if we would have brought a rescue team. Just getting the punch on them. All right, what's next? What's next? Okay, so we're just gonna talk to Mudkip right here and tell him. Oh no, we just said let's end the team. No, we're not ending the rescue team. We can't do that. Okay, and now we tell him about our dream of Garbor. But yeah, we can't cancel the rescue team. We've been working so hard. We defeated a legendary bird, and we are first evolution starter Pokemon. Like our rescue team is unbeatable. Get out of here. Let's go. Yeah, Mudkip has faith in us, and the boys come through. Oh, Charizard, Alkazam, and Titar, the big dogs. After that scene in Pokemon Square, we held a town meeting on what we must do to save the world. And we have arrived at the consensus. We must get rid of you. What you mean? What you mean? You gotta get rid of us? We will defeat you with all of our might. Dude, we gotta fight these dudes? Do we have a boss battle with the big dogs? Are you kidding me? We will give you tonight. Okay. Huh? Pack your supplies and get out of here. Come tomorrow, rescue teams of all sort will take up the chase and attack you without hesitation. Are they gonna attack us? If we don't get out of here, is that the plan? Or if we get out of here, they're still coming for us? Oh my lord. Look, dude, the whole town is ganging up on us. And the big dogs of the town. Oh, dude, I thought we were going to have a boss battle with them. Chico, in their own way, Alkazan's team has faith in you too. Didn't I say this before? I'm not going to worry anymore. Whatever happens, I'll always have faith in you, Chico. Yo, my boy Mudkip, always saying those wise words of wisdom, helping us out. Yo, my boy Caterpie. Chico, I made a promise, remember? That we would make a rescue team base here. That I would join your rescue team when I grew up. Chico, don't give up. You're a hero to me. Yo, dude, Caterpie. Caterpie, if you guys remember, we saved Caterpie back in the first episode. That was the first rescue mission we did. Where, like, we saved Caterpie for the Butterfree. But yeah, we got to get out of here. We got to leave this town and hit the bounce boogie skididdle. Because, you know, everybody's coming after us probably with, like, pitchforks and everything. <laughs> Could you imagine they come out there like, get him. I'm just stabbing us up. Morning, Trico. It's early, but of course, you'd be up by now. Are you ready to leave? Yeah, I'm ready to leave. Let's get out of here, buddy. I think I have everything that I need. Looks like we're ready. From now on, we're fugitives. This is going to be a dangerous trip. Yeah, we're fugitives, boy. <laughs> Let's go. Imagine if they put, like, we took off the scarves, put, like, little orange jumpsuits on us. But now we got another flashback. From when we first actually talked to Alkazam, I believe. I was to uncover the truth and all that good stuff. And that was actually this one. That was this, what we just did. Let's get rolling. Trico. Yo, the boys are here. These are our friends, though. I feel like these are our only friends left. They're wishing us luck, all that good stuff. And everyone else is just coming after us. Oh, and Diglett! Good morning, it's me and Diglett. I want to send you off, too. Oh, dude, my boy, Joe. All these cool boys are sending us off. And Paloop's coming out here? My boy, Palooper. What's good, dude? I always love Palooper. Oh, no, he's just giving us mail. He's not even here to give us, like, a goodbye. He's just like, here's your mail. Just doing my job. It's a letter. Take it, Trico. Let's grab it. Let's see what it says. Let's see what it says. Began reading the letter. Take care. It's a farewell for now. Until the day I can deliver mail to you. Oh, he did give us a farewell letter. Yo, my boy Pelipper. Let's go. These are our boys. These are our boys. These are our rider dies right here. They will do anything for us. But yeah, let's go hit the road. We out of here, boys. Peace out. Look at us, yo. Just hitting that strut out of here. Look at little Mudkip's feet. They're hilarious, yo. <laughs> Looks like they're moonwalking forward. Look at them. We'll be back. Let's go. Peace out, Jump Luff, Caterpie, Metapod, and Diglett. Yo, Diglett looks dope. I love how he just, like, popped out the ground. But yeah, thus began Trico's cruel and arduous journey as a fugitive. Ooh, a fugitive over forbidding mountains. Yeah, yo, we out of here. Look at this. We got fishers. Ooh. Across fields of fire. Yo, look at this. Look at us running through here. We crazy. That environment is out of control here, too. The forest fire is still raging. Dude, that's insane. Big forest fire. Where are we going? But throughout it all, Trico's team kept their heads held high. Yeah. 
course we did, because we're the best. Without a complaint, they marched on. Yes, sir. Now what do we got here? Where are we going to? Oh, we end off at a cave right here. We should travel a long way. Ooh. But while we're moving, I couldn't help thinking. All sorts of places have been affected by the natural disasters. I'm sure many Pokemon are suffering because of the calamities. I wish we could get back to doing our rescue work. Yeah, yo, I wish so too. Sorry, I shouldn't complain. We have to get away now, period. Yeah, we gotta get going. Huh? I hear voices. Are they coming? I think they went this way. Bruh, yo, these boys are chasing us. The townspeople are chasing us with, like, pitchforks. Yeah, we gotta run, we run into this cave. Is this a dungeon we gotta do? Yeah, Lapis Cave. Okay. So we got a nice little mystery dungeon to get away from the town. I think I did prepare ourselves for something to happen. Let's go. This place is dope. I gotta attack this thing. I thought we befriended it. Yeah, we gotta attack this thing. Get our Poke Coins, all that good stuff. Gotta roll through Lapis Cave. What we get here? We got a Mock Band. A Mock Ribbon. We gotta get the Friend Ribbon. The Friend Ribbon is the best one. I believe it gives a better chance of us getting friends. Iron Tail. Bilp, yo, dude. Critical it. I'm gonna hit this thing with a Mega Drain. Like, okay, we'll hit him with a nice little water move. But, yo, this place is sick. A little bit of Lapis Cave over here. Yo, we... Oh, yo, dude, come on. You gotta double kick me like that. I think we came prepared with, like, a bunch of different good stuff. Let's just take him out. Let's roll. Where's the stairs at? Right here. To that bounce boogie skittle. How many floors is this place? Lapis Cave, baby. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna sit down here. Yo, Mudkip's got that angle. I got the angle now. We hit our range moves. Yo, Bill. Paralyzed. I can just quick attack punish this thing off. Oh, no. Water well, gun's gonna tee off. Get out of here, boy. We got items. What kind of ribbon is this? What we got? We got a joy ribbon. Okay, I might have to put some ribbons on the boys here. After I take out the Zubat. We'll put some ribbons on the boys. Give them boost. I don't know if, if you use ribbons, if they're just for this dungeon, or if they hold, if you hold on to them for, like, ever. Let's give it a peek. Let's give it a peek. Let's go to toolbox. Here we go. Let's, uh, got scarves here. Defense scarves. Mock ribbon. Boost the wearer's speed. That's a nice joy ribbon. The wearer earns XP as turns go by, even if the Pokemon does a battle. Ooh, that's pretty nice pretty nice but we're just gonna give off uh defense cards we're gonna give it to trico boost our defense so we don't really take as much damage from physical attack moves and we'll give a defense scarf to uh my boy mudkip here i think that six is we don't have any of our boys like any of our pokemon that we rescued we don't have any of them i don't know if we can pick anybody up right now let's see we're gonna get a little bit of water gun action take him out i don't know if we can get any uh friends right now <gasps> what is that a tm oh we got a tm i'm asleep i'm asleep right now can i move mudkip's just gonna tee off on the same Got a Kipper. Double kick. Oh! Clean off on Monkey. Luckily, we have the defense scarf. New level up. Kip to level 20. Yeah, learn a move or something. Learn something sick, like Bubble Beam. I don't know. But Monkey Shine. Oh, Mud Sport. Okay. So that will lower fire moves. I see we send this. Let's, let's get rid of Bide, dude. I'm sick of Bide. Let's get Mud Sport. Because maybe we'll eventually go to, like, fire places. Or no, that's for electric moves, but still, we're chilling. What's this? A TM. What TM is this? Trico picked up Solar. Hmm. We got Solar Beam. We might have to give that to Trico later. It could be type nice. What you want, fool? Mud bomb's gonna come through. What you want? He's teeing off with that mud bomb. Is mud bomb a range move? That would be nice. Pick up that. These pokey dollars. We're gonna get more and more. But yeah, Lapis Cave is dope. We got all these like crystals over here. What is this? What is this item? I see, I'm seriously confused on what this item is. It's a box? Okay, I wanna pick it up and see what it does. A link box. Let's check it out. It's in our toolbox. That'll be at the end. Use it to link or de-link moves. Link or de-link moves as many moves as you'd like at once. But once you finish, the box will disappear. So I can link moves together? Use? So I'm confused to what it does. I think, I think you can link moves together and use them at once. So would that be good for like boss battles? Like I can link Iron Tail and maybe Mega Drain together and double in the moves? Is that that's kind of what I'm getting out of it? I'm really getting that out of that. But orange berry, maybe we'll try it out later. A nice little apple. You take apples all day, dude. Apples and orange berries are like a necessity. Right? Oh, I'm gonna step back here. Uh, no, I'm, I'm not. I don't want to use an orange berry. I'm gonna just step back here and have you take take some meat. And absorb this thing has absorbent wing attack. The wing attack does work on us. Like we got marked on at the Great Canyon by a wing attack. Water gonna pop through. Now let's roll. Need some HP, so we're just gonna walk here. Picking up some HP. We got an item down here. And the, and the stairs. Oh, too bad. What you want, yo? I gotta stay far away from you. Uh, I'm just gonna actually look down this way and do a little poke here. Yeah, there we go. Just waste a turn and then tee off on this thing. Bang, little quick attack. And one gun should be able to pick up the KO. Give me this Poke Dollar. And what we got up here? Another wand, dude. These wands are actually nice. What we get? A confused wand. Four of them. That's actually really good for boss battles. We can wave them in front of them. Confuse them. More Poke Dollars. Let's roll, baby. Let's roll. But yeah, look at this. This is what's good about having a water Pokemon. They can walk inside the water 
and what's it called? Grass Pokemon cannot, which is awesome, which is actually awesome. That's actually a huge benefit for picking up a water Pokemon, but fire has that same thing, and I believe grass eventually has that as well. But I think water has it more often. Pick up seeds, another slow, oh, a nice little slow one. Roll down here, left, I'm feeling left, I'm feeling left. Oh, an orb, what kind of orb we got? Oh, Dodger, well, that's type nice, we can dodge some moves with it. Orbs are probably one of the best things for boss battles, like, they're actually really good. Ooh, I forget what this thing's called. What is this thing called again? Yo, quick attack. I totally forget what it's called. Illumis. Illumis, that's what it's called. Yo, grab this Poké Dollar. Where's these stairs at, my dudes? Where are these stairs at? Oh, I, dude, I would love to get this thing on my team. Eventually, I have a Nido King. I was watching a, uh, I saw a little Pokemon Mystery Dungeon clip, and this dude's team was stacked. It was like Mega Venusaur, Mega uh, Blastoise. He had Mega Titar on his team. He had like a team of six. Of all like big mega evolutions, yeah, like Metagross, the team just looked unbeatable. Like that, I cannot wait to get like post game and be able to do all that cool stuff and get some big Pokemon on my team. Because eventually we will, we will get all that good stuff. Okay, but you already ran out of PP for your moves. Jeez, you just spam his Water Gun. That's like his favorite move. Another Link Box. Okay. Um. Okay. I don't really want this. I could swap it out. Look at all the stuff we have. We have so much stuff. To pick up everything. I kind of want everything. I don't want this that link box. You can eat me. But we can pick up these Poké Dollars if we want. I'll just pick up these Poké Dollars. Have Mudkip handle that battle. Look at that. Mud Bomb's teeing off, baby. And he's lowering his accuracy. But he still hit this land a peck. A lot of items on this floor as well, which is type nice. But since we are full now, we have to, when we pick up an item, we have to swap something out if we really want it. Like, I don't want this gravel rock right here. There's no point in me even, like, going after it. Here's steps. Oh, yeah. Get out of here. Dude, I want one of these. I don't think we can befriend anything. Oh, we definitely swapping something out for this box. Swap. What are we dropping? We got plenty of apples. Kind of want to get rid of a max ether now that we have tons of a. Uh... Actually, I'll use a max ether on Mudkip so we can pick that up. Yeah, we'll use a max ether so we can pick it up after that. And there's another apple. I might just eat an apple now, to be honest, as well, and pick up another one. That's going to be the play. That's going to be the play. Eat an apple, do all that stuff. Oh! Poison stinging me. Get out of my face. All right, let's go here. Let's go toolbox. Let's eat an apple. I really do not want him to actually pick up that gravel rock. Then we're gonna get my max ether over to the boy right here. Just to boost his little his little water gun. Give him more PP here. And then we're gonna pick up this deluxe box. Don't you dare pick up that gravel rock. We'll take it out this thing and then pick up the apple and roll out here. I'm actually kinda low on health. Mudkip, I would like to have you here. Mudkip! It'd be nice to have you here. Thank you, buddy. Actually, he stepped down and made a nice play. And now let's roll through here. Pick up this apple. Um, I need a little bit of health. Water gun. I'm, I'm actually going to eat a max ether of my own here. Waste all my uh, dragon breaths. A lot of Pokemon popping through here. What you want? Get rid of all my dragon breaths. Did we lose it? I think we have one more dragon breath left. I'm going to step to the side and finish this thing off. Because I don't think two mud bombs will take it out. Yeah, we got this. Oh, he's pecking, bro. Get out of here. Get off of him. Dragon breath hits through. We're out of it now. And now I can use a max ether. Give me that, baby. Give me that. Pick it up, Trico. Because, yo, we're, our storage is full. We're honestly just full here. Let's go. Let's get smooth and groovy. In Lapis Cave. How many floors is this? We did a nice little great, great Canyon here today. And we're doing Lapis Cave for a good amount of floors. Hit this move. I can actually, I can uh, get, hit a quick attack. Here, but Mud Bomb should be able to take out. Yeah, get out of my face. Now he's out of Mud Bombs as well. There's so many Pokemon here and the Great Canyon. But we're just getting far, farther into the game. Like more stuff is happening. Quick attack. Oh, big crit on the quick attack. Water gun for the KO. Let's head up here. We got some items. Do we want any of these? Oh, yeah, we do. We want these Poké Dollars, dude. Let's turn our stats to normal as well and then head through the steps. Uh-huh. La Pisque, baby. What kind of wand is this? I really want to know. Oh, we can just pick it up. It's a whirlwind wand. I think that's just a confusion wand. Who is that? Who's, who's causing us trouble? Kip, you got him. He's going to peck you. You can eat up pecks all day. Oh, he poisons you. Don't you dare get poisoned. I'll dragon breath you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get him out of here. Let's actually roll here. Roll down this way. I have a feeling it's down here. Oh, we can turn our stats to normal. Yes, sir. Make it grooving, grooving. Iron Tail. Dude, <laughs> big damage. 40. Yo, dude, Iron Tail is too good. Iron Tail is too good. We got here. Yes, Poké Dollars. We're racking up the Poké Dollars. I love it. I need a floor, but there's an enemy right here. Step up here. A little bit of breath. Go ahead, step up another position. I'm going to whap you with this Iron Tail. Actually, there's no need now. There's no need. We don't need that much damage. Actually, there was need. We should have sent it. We should have sent it. Head this way. Stairs, are you up here? Stairs? There they are. Thank you, stairs. Onward! Eighth floor. I believe there's probably another ten, probably ten floors for this place. 
just like the Great Canyon, I feel like it's probably 10 to 12. Is most of the floors that or dungeons that we are doing now are getting longer. Yo, what are those? We got specs. What are these? We got fickle specs. Want to quick it boost critical hit? Uh, hmm. When using a different move than the turn before. I kind of want to pick them up. I do want to pick them up. Let's drop. Can I swap for something? I can't pick it up, but I'll swap for something. Let's swap it. Okay. Uh, what do we want out of here? Orange berries, max elixirs, tiny revivers. Let's get rid of this eye drop scene. Stick you eye drop scene. Let's roll. Let's roll, baby. Enemies are gonna be coming through here. I'm gonna mark on. Good. It's just one. I see him on the left side. What you want? But it's kind of crazy when you walk through these tunnels. You can only see like three tiles ahead of you, so they made it a little bit harder to, for you to see and use long range moves. Let's go. Let's get moving. There's the steps and the Poke Dollars. Don't mind if I do. Look at all this cash line. That was only 11, bro. I mean, like 50 something. Make me worthwhile. Stairs are right here as well, but there's an item up here. And I want to take on this gold bat. Iron Tail. Actually, I shouldn't have did that. Unless this water gun kills. Thank you, because that wing attack could have just one tapped me. See, I knew there was a reason for us to... Actually, I don't even want this apple. I knew there was a reason for us to... That we had 70-some HP. We had 70-some in the Great Canyon, because we only had 55. I knew that wasn't true. True. <gasps> a Tangler. I love the Befriend of Tangler. Bro, yo, he just vine with my Kipper, dude. Get him out of here. Get him gone. We paralyzed you. You want to vine with my Kipper? That's what you get, dude. Yeah, I don't think we can be befriend anybody, because, like, we don't have anything right now, because we're fugitives. We're just running away. We're chilling, we're chilling. What we got down here? Pokey dollars? Yes, sir. Tango almost the sauce again. Yo, he's going after my boy. Hands off, yo. Hands off. There you go. We got another Dragon Breath off. Let me paralyze, yo. Dragon Breath's so nice for the paralyze. Oh, another deluxe box. Give it to me. Give it to me. Swapping that. These things are the bomb. Let's get rid of, uh, Warren Bears. We have tons of them. What do I want to get rid of? A slink box, an apple, a totter seed. Totter seeds are nice. Hmm. Confused one, slow one. Let's get rid of these world ones. Actually, we just dropped them. That's fine. I'm chilling with it. What are you doing? Oh, yo, he vine whipped you. Hands off, buddy. Yo, oh, you paralyze him again. Get him out of here. Tackle. Yeah, you're critting. Yo, that still didn't kill him? That's insane. That's insane. Where's the floor at? Pokey dollars? Yes, sir. Yo, we racking him up in here. Any over here? Orange berry, we can't win. Yo, take him out. Yo, you. Yo, I'm having too much fun with this game. This game is incredible, yo. If you haven't tried out a Mystery Dungeon game, this is probably one of the Mystery Dungeon games you should get started with. Because it's like the first one and it's just so much fun. We have a good old time with it. Yo, there's a Bagon next to me. A Bagon? However you pronounce it. Bagon, Bagon, whatever you want to say it as. Yo, this Tango is eating up some shots. I'm going to take out this bomb out of this shit. And there's another box I got to pick up. Yo, we ever know! Yo, leave me alone. I'm going to actually step back. I'm going to have Mudkip do some work here. I don't want to get Embered on. Yeah, Mudkip can't eat that one up. I'm actually go. No! I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. I gotta eat an orange berry now. Yeah, thank you, Mudkip. This hunk of junk. I meant to step diagonal so I could get the angle on him, but I guess that's not working. Thank you, Mudkip. I'm a tee off one. You wanna play games with me? Get Iron Tail. Alright, let's swap this. Oh no, we can just pick that up. That's type nice, baby. Yeah. Where's the floor at? More money, dude. We racking up it though. Where's the stairs at? There they are. We're on 10th floor. Is this the end? I feel like we're getting close. 11th floor. Insane. What you want, dude? Quick attack. Boop! Tackle. Oh, of course you missed your tackle. Iron Tail. Yes, sir. Big damage. Tackle should take out. What kind of orb is this? Orbs are the best. Slow orb. Ah, I'm fine with it. I'm fine with not taking it. There's a Kelkion shop, it looks like. There. See what I'm saying there? I think there's a Kelkion shop. What we got? Oh! Only Kip can get in there. Yo, dude, that's dope. Get a Kip. I'm actually eating an apple as well. And have Kip grab another apple. <laughs> Yo, that's so cool. So you need a water Pokemon to get all those items. You guys kept grabbing that. Thank you, buddy. Let's roll. Is that a Kelkion shop? I believe it is. Let's see. Yeah, it is. Got any goodies here? Uh, no nothing too good here. Nothing too, too good here. So I'm just going to pass it up. Oh, yo. Hands off, buddy. Supersonic. Of course you confuse us. I'm not even going to move. I'm just going to take a step. Have Kipper do some work. Got Kip T off on him. Kip, you got to Finish him. Of course you confuse me. That hunk of junk. All right, let's roll. Where are the stairs? There's so many enemies. Like, you see that? There's four right there. I'm gonna step up here. And go for the Iron Dragon. Start team up on him. Get him, baby. Yo, you bit me? I mean, that's why I'm sending these Mega Drains. Get some HP back. Nice little tenor. Nice little 10 HP. Amber. Oh! I should be able to KO here. Oh, yeah. We got our, our Overgrow, which is type nice. I'm gonna hit you with that Iron Tail, baby. And strict. Oh, you little hunk of junk. Let's go. Overgrow is gonna help us do some more damage. Of course, we missed. Yeah, I guess I'll use an Orange Berry. No! Bro, I meant to use an orange berry. But 31 damage. Is that KO here? It's 16 HP. Vine Whip's gonna come through. We surviving here, yo. This overgrow ability is helping boost our grass moves and give us more HP here so we just survive. Type nice. 
Hey, nice, baby. Come on, overgrow coming up clutch. Where do we gotta go? I guess we gotta go this way. We just walked all the way around and hit, got nothing. What you want, Golbat? I should I should actually step back at this. I know he's just biting us. Give me that. Yeah, give me your HP. Hopefully it's chaos. Oh! Luckily we got reviver seeds. We got him. We got him. We're chilling here. Came prepared. Came prepared. We found a ton as well. I should have stepped back. I said it. I said it, but I always check out for time. Kind of orb is this? Oh no, we are we already we we checked all this stuff. We don't want it. Head up here. Stairs? Yes, sir! And a couple extra Poke dollars for us. Going to floor uh, 12, dude. Going to floor 12. We're going a long run here. Now pick up that apple. Oh, no, you can't pick up the apple. Where's the next stairs? All these Poke dollars, though. I feel like we're getting so much extra Poke dollars. I'll get behind you. Kip's got it. Oh, what just happened? Get him, Kip. Oh, he did something crazy. Um, yeah, I'm gonna step up here and give you an orange berry. Because <laughs> I don't know how many tiny reviver seeds we have left. I really do not know. Kip, take him out, buddy. He's gonna leer. Drop his defense. He's gonna do some big damage on him as well. I don't think I have anything. Oh my god. Do I have a dragon breath? I do not. I'm gonna step up. Uh, I think Mudkip can actually kill him here. Mudkip, do it. Do him dirty. Yes, sir, Mudkip. Don't want to waste my orange berries if I don't have to. Let's roll this way. Uh, down or up? Let's go up. I'm gonna follow this Pokemon up here. We are we are pinched. We're getting pinched over here. I'm gonna guess the stairs are here. Nope, Tango's sleeping. I'm not messing with him. I'm not messing with him. Of course we got a gust trap. Dude, these are the worst traps. Oh no, no, never mind. There's some traps that send you to a different floor than your teammate. Those are the worst. Like I'm telling you guys. Absolute terrible. Alright, let's take this thing on. I can actually kick attack through. Nope. I don't want to burst the gold backs. It is wing attack. I swear, if Kip hits me, I'm going to be kind of mad. But Kip's confused here. He's getting teed off. I'm going to have to swap spots with him. Ooh, Iron Tail. Finish him. Yes, sir. Oh, my lord, dude. Kip got confused. Let's roll. Let's get out of here. Alright, I see a Pokemon right here. Uh, Iron Tail's going to tee off. I don't think we have any PP left. Uh, Vine Whip. Overgrowth's going to come in clutch. Big Mega Drain. Get that 28. 14 HP back. Yeah, get out of here. Enemy defeated. We got some HP here as well. I don't think I have any, uh... Ooh! 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 I'm going to step back. I'm going to step back. Kip, I'll give you an orange berry. Just take this one on. Oh, he missed. Beautiful. Get him, Kip. Yes! Let's go, dude. These gold bats are a pain in my neck. Pain in my neck, but there we go. 412. We still got another one. Dang. Dang, bruh. What you want? I'm, I'm running out of like PP on my moves, but I feel like this dungeon is almost over, so I'm gonna just keep teeing off here. Doing some work. Oh, big level up. Level 21. Give it to me. Give it to me. Show me a new move. Show me a new move. I would love to learn something cool. Chico's trying to learn. Giga Drain. Give it to me, baby. See you later, Mega Drain. I'm gonna get all that PP back as well. Look at that. Look at that. Big moves for Chico. Where are these stairs at, though? Where are these stairs at, though? We are hungry, I know, but I feel like we have one more floor left. I just feel like. What we got here? Don't show me a gold bat. Oh! Mm. Iron Tail on it. Of course we miss. I got to sit back. Um, can I throw something at him? What do we got here? Toolbox. Hmm. Blast Seed. Slumber Orb. Uh, bu -bu -bu. what do I want to use? I got to use something to get him out of here. Uh, I want to eat it. All dodge orb. What should I do here? That thing's going to tee off. Let's just go. Do I have a blast seed? I'm going to throw a blast seed at him. Do I have a blast seed? I thought I had a blast seed. Yeah. You know what? I'm not playing around anymore. <laughs> no! I thought I could throw through him. I teed off on the boy. I teed off on him. I legit just teed off on my dude. Giga Drain comes out here. Do big damage. Dude, I threw a blast seed at my Mudkip. What do you mean? <laughs> I didn't even mean it. I thought I could throw it through. I chucked it at him. Did 75 damage. Now we are in green. I'm going to get some HP back as well. I got to check about tiny, tiny Reviver Seeds. Actually, let me just do this. I think I have more. I do not. I do not. So we are going to have to maybe throw a slow one. What do we, do we have any? Whirlwind one? What's Whirlwind one? Knocks that Pokemon flying. The Pokemon takes damage. Hits the wall. Okay, I'm actually just slow this thing down. And start teeing off on him. Wave it. I'm not dealing with these dudes. Iron Tail, land, please. Yes, sir. He's slower. Bruh. It's down to my kip. It is down to my kip. I gotta give him something. I, I Like, I slowed that thing down for a reason. I'm gonna just give this thing a max electric plate save. It's down to my kip, baby. Oh, we're getting teed off on here. But I slowed that thing down for a reason, thinking I can get two hits on him and finish him off. Of course not. But it's down to my Kip. We have no more revives here. But Kip is a little behind on the, uh, what's it called anyway? 
He's a little behind on the... the what's it called? What am I trying to say? The XP, so this will actually be good for him. It could trick me. Uh, do I have something to heal the poison? Oh my god, I'm getting terrified here. It's coming down to the wire. Chip's poison. Where's the steps at? There's so many items over here. The steps. Oh my god, dude. Poison is teeing off of me. Do we have anything to help out with the poison? We have nothing to help out on the poison? Petra berries? No. Oh, yes, it does. Petra berries are for it. Yes, sir. Let's go. We have any extra Petra berries just in case? Orbs here. I'll take this orb. Bow hold orb. Oh, we gotta get out of here. Where are the stairs? Tangle, leave me alone. Get up here. Is this the end? 14. Oh, my lord. I'm gonna take a step back. I'm gonna take a step back again. I'm a corner. I'm in the corner. Oh, my lord. Water gun. Supersonic. Did it land? Of course it did. Yes, we hit that water gun. Take him out. Astonish. No! I'm sorry. No! Are you kidding me? No! Back at floor 14, we took a whooping from that gold bat. That thing is scary. I've been straying away from them as I've been making my way back up this lapis cave, but we lost all of our items, all of our boxes, our pokey dollars we found in this. So I've been traveling up this with no items. No, but I've been finding some good ones, been chilling with it. Got some max elixirs to actually give the PG back to my uh, Pokemon, all that good stuff. We are out of it right now, but these gold bats are our biggest fear. These guys hit like a truck. If you use Fairy Cutter on me, I'm dead. There's another one on her tail right here. I'm actually going to use a Max Ether. Give me that uh, my Dragon Breath back because that is a good way to actually tee off on these guys. Because Fury Cutter kills me in one hit. It kills. It does like 70 some damage and just tees off of me. So a good way for me to actually take on these things is actually by going into like these Dragon Breaths. Oh, we hit him with a Wing Attack. Get out of here. The Dragon Breath can is my range move and I could potentially get a Paralyze as well. They've really been helping me out. Let's slide over here. Get in front of this thing. Yeah, so range move's been coming up clutch. I believe we died on the last floor. Like we got teed off on. But yeah, sometimes these Pokemon Mystery Dungeon games can do it whooping on you they do whooping on you you guys play these games you guys can tell like just random times just get teed off on you're like what do you what do you mean you did that much damage but we're gonna pick up some of these items before you go out here lost berry a faux hold orb and a faux seal orb is this the end man we were one floor away from beating this but we successfully made it through the lapis cave we got one treasure chest with a nice little dx gummy i'll take that i will take that all day items have been sent to storage that's fine by me that's fine by me, but we make our way out this cave after being chased by the whole town, I think it is. But did we get away from them? That's my question. Hey, look over there. Over there. Catch Shrieko. Oh my god, they're on to us again. Get out of here. So we're on the move again. Running over there. Stop right there. Don't let them get away. They expect us to stop and wait for them. Nah, yo, we're not. We out of here. Gasp, gasp. Oh no, look. Oh no, are they there? Oh, we're in a mountain. Okay. Like a magma mountain. Yo, this place is sick. Do we have to go there? Is that Mountain of Fire? It's Mount Blaze. Look at all that lava pouring from the crater. Can we even make it through there? Oh, are we going to have to go there? Is that where Moltres lives? I believe Moltres is over there because there was Mount Thunder, Mount Blaze. This has got to be where we do our Moltres boss fight. That is going to be awesome. I cannot wait to do it. We run towards Mount Blaze. This is our only way out. It's our only way to get past the people from jumping us and probably beating us up and killing us. So we're on our way to Mount Blaze, dude. That's dope. I cannot wait face off against Moltres. Right? That's where we're going, right? That's what he said, Mount Blaze. I think, I think they're gone. Yeah, we are here, baby. We are here at Mount Blaze. Look at this place. It's all magma -y. Oh, and we got a little save point here. That's dope. That's cool. Mount Blaze, baby. We're going to be taking on Moltres soon. That is so sick. It's just a lava mountain that we got to go into. That's, I'm going to struggle with my Trico, so I got to prepare for it with this little Kangaskhan storage. But, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be taking on Moltres. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.